for 15 years. Live from the 5 Eyewitness News Studios, it's your happy hour and a half. Twin Cities Live. Hey everybody, welcome into Twin Cities Live on this Wednesday. So nice to have you here with us this afternoon. I'm hanging out solo here in the studio because Ben Lieber is kicking off the holidays. He's celebrating the holidays at Mall of America. We have a fabulous, very fun, festive show for you today. He's going to check out all of the fun, the Candy Cane Institute. He's gonna meet a jolly old elf and he's gonna show us some of the fun rides at Nickelodeon Universe. I heard he took a few of those rides. We'll see how it went. And back here, Mall of America style expert, Sarah Rogers. She is showing off her annual gift guide. We can't wait to see what she's picked out. She has products for all sorts of price ranges. Plus, it is my favorite set of stories of the year. You guys know this, I've been counting it down. 12 Days of Cookies kicks off today. Who is ready for it? We're making these sweet little festive Linzer cookies with my good friend Zoe Francois from the Magnolia Show, Zoe Bakes. She's, of course, the author of Zoe Bakes Cakes and the co-author of the Artisan Bread in Five Minutes a Day series. She's wonderful, and I think you're going to have a great time hanging out with us and baking some cookies. So that's coming up a little bit later in the show, but first, we are going to check in on Bloomington. The magic of the holiday season is underway. Ben Lieber live inside the largest mall in the country, the Mall of America, next to some larger-than-life toys. Hey, buddy, how you doing out there? Well, buddy, I'm doing great. It's a little bit of role reversal, right? Last week you are at Sam's Christmas Village. I was holding down the studio, and now we're swapping. Uh, yeah, you're right. I'm here at the Mall of America. It's, it's the nation's largest mall, and I tell you what, it's the na nation's most festive mall as well. Uh, it's not subtle, you guys. It's not subtle at all. When you walk in to this north entrance here on the first level of the Mall of America, uh, Christmas, the holidays just kind of punch you right in the face. You get uh, greeted by a whole bunch of elves. You've got music playing from these these snowflakes that are hanging above me. And you guys, I just want to tell you right now, quick a quick disclaimer. These elves that you see behind me, it sounds like they're gonna be traveling with me throughout the whole day. If you come to the Mall of America, don't be as mischievous as them, okay? They get special privileges because they kind of work here a little bit. So if you bring your kiddos here, maybe don't climb all over this stuff like this. Uh, but we love facts, right? We love facts and figures. We love to educate you guys on this show. So let's talk about some facts. As you walk in, to this north entrance here in this atrium, you're gonna be greeted by a whole bunch of holiday decorations. How many, you say? Well, how about this? There are seven 11-foot nutcrackers. As you walk in, as you walk down the hallway, they're here to greet all of the guests. Seven 11-foot nutcrackers, you guys. That's a lot of nuts to crack here at the Mall of America. They also, throughout the whole mall, 500 decorative trees. 3,500 poinsettias are used to decorate all the common areas in the vent spaces. And then, as you guys go into the Huntington Bake Rotunda, you're going to notice two 44-foot-tall trees as well, and each tree has 32,000 lights. That's a lot of lights. Well, it's festive around here. You're definitely going to feel like you're in the holiday spirit. It's not just the decorations as well. The Mall of America has events planned throughout the whole month here at the Mall of America. So let's bring in Laura Utek from the Mall of America. Good afternoon, Ben. Thank you Good so much afternoon. for joining us today. Yes, thanks for joining me as well and Twin Cities Live. Um, you've got a ton of events going on, uh, not only coming up, but throughout the whole month. We, we talk about the magic of the holidays, and, and with that comes the music as well. You guys have music and some uh, festivities going on the whole month. What, what can you tell us about do. that? we got the holiday music uh, festival that's going to be happening in the Rotunda, presented by Minnesota Sports and Events, a fantastic event. You can check out our website to see the full lineup of local bands and musicians, and it's so much fun. It really gets people into the holiday spirits, and really, as soon as you walk in the door, take a look at these guys right here. I mean, they're mischievous MOA 
elves. They're all over the place. You can't help but smile the second you walk into the door. Well, like I was saying, when you walk in and you hear these snowflakes, snowflakes uh, playing some music, and then you guys have music throughout the whole... It was perfect timing it for the right? It was perfect timing. As you mentioned, you're going to have music kind of throughout the whole month, so mm -hmm. it's, it's hard not to just smile. Exactly. You know, get yourself a cup of coffee or something. Just walk around. We and got enjoy. lots of options for coffee. Am yes, I right? You, you guys need it. Being up early in the morning, too, doing all kinds of shows, but it's so much fun. But on top of that, there's a lot of different charitable activations yes. we have as well. Festival of Trees that we're going to be talking about uh, later this uh, afternoon as well. We've got every meal, which is right down the hallway here. A dollar twenty-five is one meal for a student. So a lot of students out on winter break time don't have a meal. And so to be able to provide that for those individuals really goes a long way and makes such a difference and such an impact within our community as well. On top of that, we've got Clouds Choir that's going to be happening on Friday. It's an annual event. It's so much fun. It kicks off with the KS95 for Kids Radiothon all day long. People can call in, show up, donate for children's cancer research, and then closing out the day then with singing clouds and holiday tunes. And it really uh, honors the life and legacy of Zach Sobiak. Uh, it's, he was such an inspirational person and we even have a new ambassador individual that people will meet on Friday as well. And you mentioned KS95. That means Dez and Chris Gill. Oh, and those guys be will here be here. As well. They are going to be here in person, and they are such characters. I was here last year for Clouds Choir, and you just you can't help but choke up. And those guys were tearing up on the stage with the insane amount of money that they raised throughout the event. These guys are a little they are everywhere. In the oh my gosh. Saying, Look at these guys. The sugar and the everything. syrup is kicking in. Okay, so that's on Friday. You yep. actually have a big event even starting tomorrow we with the Special Olympics of Minnesota. Special they have Olympics a big anniversary come up. 50th anniversary. Can you believe that? 50 years. And they are such an incredible organization impacting so many individuals, supporting equality for all. It's just something that we really support. It means so much to us here at Mall of America. So we talk a lot about music and the festivities going on, but also it's the Mall of America. So people want to come here and shop as well. Oh, you guys have a great deal shop. with the Holiday Rewards Program we as do. well. Yes, the Holiday Rewards Program is fantastic, and it's easier than ever this year. All you have to do is download the Mall of America app. You can easily set up your account with MOA Insiders. And now through Christmas Eve, you can earn four points for every dollar spent, and you can cash in those points for fantastic rewards, attraction passes, dining perks, a um, little bit of everything, which is just so nice. Our VIP tours, if you haven't done a VIP tour, make sure you do it. We got to get you on one of those. I will definitely do that. I, I know, perfect guy. I think his <laughs> name is Dan Jasper that can take you on an MOA tour. He is so much fun, but it, it's just really great, and you can either use it for yourself or maybe even a stocking stuffer as well. Well, I tell you what, Laura, this is just the start of what we have going on today on Twin Cities Live here at the Mall of America. Thank you for all the events and all the lineups and everything that's coming up, yep. all the festivities. Uh, we also, oh my oh. gosh, we've got Santa coming in. Merry Christmas. You guys, we've got Santa here. How are you feeling? This is just the start of the season. Are you, are you ready? Are you geared up? We have a lot of work to do, but I have confidence in my elves. We can get it done. Okay, you guys, I'm going to find out later on. Santa and I, we're going to have a conversation. We're going to figure out if I'm naughty or nice this year. We'll see Can how that goes. Can you Santa? We're... Yeah, we have some work to do, Ben. We have some work to do. Okay, okay, not, not all is lost. Okay, we're also going to visit the Candy Cane Institute as well. Look, we got a, a lot to get to. I mean, there's, there's elves running around. I mean, they're, they're wearing me out. I'm, uh, I'm hopefully they, they didn't break anything, you guys. So, Elizabeth. We got a lot to get to today. This is just the start. You can take it away. Sounds fun. All right. Thank you so much, Ben. All right. You work things out with Santa, okay? And we'll check in with Ben a little bit later in the show. We've got all sorts of fun things planned from Mall of America. But right now, it is time for Tree CL Trivia. Roll it. Let's go. Our Christmas tree is surrounded by presents, all filled with prizes from Shields. Each one is worth at least $150, and we want to give them all away. We're three for three so far, you guys. Uh, this year, each of our presents have themes, so maybe you'll win a family game night package or even a Vikings-themed prize. Well, today, we've got Greg from Mound on the phone. We want to continue that winning streak. Hello there, Greg. Hello, Elizabeth. How are you? 
I'm doing great. I'm oh. so blessed and thankful. Oh, we're so happy that you're here. Listen, we've got a photo of you, Greg. And Greg, we heard that you were even on our AAA trip to Austin, Texas with Kristen Hobrick in September. Oh my gosh, look at this cute picture. I love this. Yep, it was a very fun trip. Oh, fabulous. That's wonderful. Well, we know Kristen had a great time. And uh, Greg, we're hoping for the best here. You watched yesterday's show, didn't you? Yes, I did. Okay. All right. I'm going to give you your question. Here it is. In yesterday's show, your friend and mine, Kristen Hobrick, was live from somewhere in the South Metro. She was kicking off the winter season. What activity was Kristen doing? She was skiing she, at Buck Hill. She was skiing at Buck Hill. Oh, my gosh. This is so exciting. There she was having a great time just crushing it, just shredding it on the slopes. Okay, Greg, I'm walking over. I'm going to grab a gift for you. Let's see. I think I'm going to take this one back. Oh, wait. Now, maybe it'll be this one. Okay, I'm going to grab this, and we're going to open it up. Way to go, Greg. How you feeling? I am feeling great and blessed. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what a sweetheart you are. Okay, I'm going to open this gift up and I'm going to see what you have inside. Oops, whoops, whoops. Let's see what we're going to get. Ben is so jealous that he's not here, but I'm going to I'm going to make sure he knows that you won. Oh my goodness, this is fun. You won a s'mores package. Wow. Wow. Okay, this means that you guys can cozy up anytime and make really fun uh, s'mores. You're going to win a Mesa Solo Stove, a telescoping set of forks. I don't know what that means, but it sounds really amazing. Uh, solo Stove Color Packs, and then a Hershey S'mores case to hold all of the fixings and everything you need. The total value is $154.95. Please tell me you're a s'mores fan, Greg. Oh, I love s'mores. My wife and I do and our grandkids. Oh, okay, listen. This is going to be the hit with the grandkids. You're going to set up this whole thing, and you're going to make some wonderful memories. I love this, Greg. This is so exciting. Okay, tell me the, the event you're looking most forward to over the holiday season. What do you love the most? Well, we're going to celebrate Christmas with our family this Sunday at the only time we can get together. Oh, my All 16 God. of us. Oh, no way. This Sunday, you're going to celebrate. I think that's great. I love that not being too attached to the day and just making it the celebration whenever everyone can be together. That's the most important part. I agree. Awesome, Greg. Thank you for watching. Give your wife a big hug for us, okay? Congratulations. Oh, well, thank you, Elizabeth. Have a great day. You too. Yeah. Greg won. Yeah. Guys, the winning streak continues. We're four for four. Tracy, you feeling good about this? Everybody's pumped. That is awesome. Okay, listen, much more fun to come after the break. The woman who's always in the know at Mall of America, there she is, Sarah Rogers. She's joining us here in the studio with her gift guide this season, Gifts for All Budgets, coming up next on Twin Cities Live. Twin Cities Live host chat is presented by Sam's Christmas Village in Light Tour, just east of the Twin Cities in Somerset, Wisconsin. A must-see this holiday season.